एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू न्यू ट्यूटोरियल विद मी कीर्ति टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू मेक अ वेरी फन क्यूट प्रोजेक्ट अपसाइकल फोन केस ऑल द प्रोडक्ट्स यूज्ड इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आर स्पॉन्सर्ड बाय क्राफ्ट एंगल्स आई एम एन आर्टिस्ट नॉट इन होल्डर बट आई हैव बीन होल्डिंग दिस फोन केस टू ट्रांसफॉर्म इट आई डिसाइडेड टू गिव इट अ ट्राई सो आई क्लीन इट अप एंड यूजिंग दिस एवरी डे प्लेसेज क्राफ्ट एंगल्स डिको पेज पेपर्स आई गेव इट अ न्यू लुक After going through the designs I realized that this tiny little part of Eiffel Tower on the cover is perfect for the primer I used mixed media gesso by Craft Angles coated up my phone case really well as this is an upcycled project and this phone case was very 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 harshly used so I decided that I need to prepare it really well for my decoupage surface while the gesso dries let us cut out this central piece of eiffel tower i have cut really very close to the design and then i will be using decoupage glue by craft angles for pasting it on my phone case but in this one the most important step is getting the accurate background color for our eiffel tower so i have used here multiple shades of blue yellow and teal to create the background effect of daytime and i have simply followed the color palette of the original decoupage papers so while i do this i would leave you with some music after this paint is dried next step is decoupaging the design with the help of decoupage glue onto the background and later we will be using decoupage varnish by craft angles to coat it up after the layer of decoupage varnish we are going to use liquid glaze all the instructions you can see there on the bottle itself so liquid glaze is going to provide a kind of resin finish to your project so phone case is something which is very harshly used every day it is so much of time in our hand it goes into the bag it goes into the pocket so it is very important to protect the surface very well that's why i decided to go to the next level of varnish which is gloss allow the curing time of 3 4 hours and then it is ready that is the final look of my project i hope you like this see you in the next video and remember you can always find me on facebook youtube and instagram under the name kitty's craft castle thank you bye bye